Form four, form four chemistry. Okay, long time no see. 好久不见，好吗<笑> ？Okay, number one. If you're not having the note, 我讲话一些。Okay, 如果你没有 note， 自己劳碌，自己赢。But chapter four, 如果没有错，已经分给你了。如果没有的话，我也忘记了。其实很久没有做工啊。Okay, 如果没有，自己印一下。然后 make sure you having the notes before we can start our title 啦哈。那我在讲话讲话的时候，你要抄东西，有 pause the video， 你停一下，让你抄。抄工又再停一下。Okay, 不明白拉回来，又再停一下。然后如果听到很精彩，喜欢听，就再拉回来，再听多一次。那晚上再看多一次，明天再看多两次，一直看一直看。那给妈咪看，那过后妈咪也早上看一次，下午也看两次。<笑> OK， 来，不要废话了。We start. OK， our title chapter four. 我们从第四课开始。Maybe we start a bit. 我们可能开始一点点了。我全部忘记了。OK， 什么都忘记了。哦、oh, ，sorry， 忘记看 camera， 忘记看你，一直看自己的电脑。OK， 自己讲自己爽。对不起 ，start now. Okay, so chapter four, periodic table of element, or in Chinese, 我们叫它元素周表 Okay, 元素周表 And now, or、oh, this is a table, lah. You have this table in your notes. 这个表格在你的 notes 里面也是有的 Okay, so chapter four is a good chapter, 很好的 chapter 来的 We can start now. Okay. For page number two, or maybe page number three, this I mean. Okay, our first title, our new syllabus, sing syllabus, the first title, historical development, development of the periodic table. 元素周表从哪里来？它怎样被发展出来 ？But the problem is here. Now you don't know what is mean by periodic table. Okay, you totally not understand. You totally don't know what is mean by periodic table. How can you understand the history? 你怎样明白它的历史呢 ？So for this title, I skip. 我跳 ，OK， 你完全没有 basic， 他讲什么你不明白什么，读了也是无聊，对不对 ？So copy under your page number three or five， 随便一面啦。OK， 那 copy here。I will only understand this title after I finish the chapter four， so come back later， 过后才回来了，好吗 ？So I jump jump to page number six， 我们跳去第六面了。OK， oh before I go to page number six， OK。We maybe have to go to the cover first. We can only look at the cover first. Go back to your cover. Look at the cover. Okay, the first question in your exam, the first question they ask, how is a periodic table of elements arranged? So how the elements, how the elements in the periodic table arrange? 怎样把这些这个元素周表排出来呢 ？Or the element in the periodic table, how are they arranged into a table? 怎样把它们变成一个表格呢 ？Oh, your answer, 你的答案 ，copy your answer here 啦。Above your cover, 抄在你的封面的最上面，最上面。Okay, so how are the elements arranged into a table called periodic table of elements? 那 your answer, 你的答案。The elements are arranged with the increasing proton number horizontally. 用增加这个 proton number 从左手排到右手。Okay, copy first. I wait for you. I 等你一下。哇，很快，好了。So now I explain what's the meaning. 什么意思呢？那 hydrogen number one, 它一号。Number two, helium, a house. So the elements are arranged with the increasing proton number. 用增加这个 proton number. Okay, arrange from left to the right, from above go below. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 从左手排起右手，用增加这的 proton number 从左手排起右手。So this is your answer. Okay, and now turn to page number six, 转去第六面 You copy the answer for second time. 抄这个答案第二次。So how are the elements arranged into a table called periodic table of elements? 将把这些元素排成一个表格，叫做元素周表呢？那再操作一次。In the periodic table, the elements are arranged according to their order, according to the order of their proton number, which increase horizontally. Different book, different sentence, 不一样的书，不一样的句子 ，but the meaning all same. Only arranged with increasing. 
proton number horizontally， 用增加这个 proton number， 从左手慢慢排排去右手了。Okay， set up， and now page number six also 再抄到一句话。The element in the same group have the same chemical properties， 同组的元素有同样的化学特征。Element in the same group, but the problem is here. What is mean by group? What is called group? Okay, element in the same group have the same chemical properties. 同组的元素有同样的化学特征。So what is mean by group? What is called group? Okay, now this is what we call group. Group, group. 一条一条直直的呢就叫 group. So element in the same group having the same chemical properties. 同组的元素有同样的化学特征 ，but 什么意思呢 ？I show you one example. So let's say I'm going to prepare one experiment in the lab today. 今天我在科学是要做一个实验 ，and our experiment need maybe sodium. 我们的实验可能要用到一种化学物品叫 sodium. Okay, but in our lab there's no sodium anymore. Sodium 没有了 ，so what to do? Simple. You look at the table. 你看这个表格。Element in the same group, 同组的元素 having the same chemical properties. So if I not having the sodium, I maybe replace the sodium with potassium. 我用另外一个来代替 Okay, sodium, potassium, they are same group. They having the same chemical properties. 他们有同样的化学特征 But remember, don't tell the student. 啊，你不要告诉学生说你把 sodium 变成 potassium 了。他们什么都不知道的，对吧？ Okay, but what are the chemical properties? Their properties are what? Okay, and now in this chapter four, we're going to discuss one by one, group by group. So here, I'm not going to discuss in detail. I just go through only. And after this, it will be the main title, group one, group seventeen, eighteen. These are all I will discuss in detail. So now, group one, they are alkali metal. They are alkaline metal. Alkaline metal. Lithium, sodium, potassium, rubidium, cesium, and francium. They are alkali metal, 碱性的金属 I was mean by alkali metal. You take the metal, you put them into the water, and after the chemical reaction, the water become alkali. 你的水呢就会变成 alkali. So that's why we call alkali metal, 碱性的金属它们跟水起反应，你的水变成 alkali. Okay. And how about group two? 第二组呢有什么颜有什么特征呢 ？Oh, this is group two 啦。这一组就叫 group two. Any chemical properties? Basically, they are same as group one. 他们跟 group one 都是一样的。But they are less reactive when compared to the group one. 他们跟水起反应的时候啊，它没有这样活跃。Okay, so they are called alkali earth matter. Alkali earth matter. Almost same as alkali metal, but but they're less reactive. They're less reactive. So we call them alkali earth metal. Okay. How about group seventeen? They are hydrogen. They're all called hydrogen. I always mean by hydrogen, lusu, or it's called lusu, lumin the lu lah, lusu, fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine, astatine. They are hydrogen. So we call hydrogen. Any characteristic 有什么特征呢 ？They react with water to become acid. 它们跟水起反应呢，你的水会变成 acid. Okay. Our group eighteen, 第十八组 Okay, 后面后面的一组了 Group number eighteen. 那 helium here 这整组啊 ，they are group number eighteen. So any chemical properties? Their chemical properties is there's no chemical properties. 它们的化学特征就是没有化学特征。化学性质不活跃 ，unreactive. They cannot start any chemical reaction. 不能开始任何化学反应。So group eighteen we call noble gases. 不活跃的气体 noble gas. And group two to twelve, 从第三到第十二组 ，they are here. 他们在这边。Okay, from group three until group number twelve. 呢 ，three until twelve. 在这个三股里面的这十组呢。Group three until group twelve, they are what? They are transition matter, 过渡金属 or they are the matter, normal matter that we can see. Lah, they are usually the things we see in daily life. For example, iron, tin, okay, copper, iron, silver, zinc, they will be in this group. They are all 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 in this group.
镀金属 transition method. Okay, but some of them they are very sensitive. They 一看就想到很多东西了 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Why we don't see the thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen? Now, 十七十八就出来了，对不对 ？So where is the front group? And what are the characteristics? 这四组啊，刚才没有提到的，他们是什么特征呢 ？So thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. They don't having the fixed chemical property. 这四组呢没有固定的化学特征，所以 I cannot tell you what is the chemical properties 啊。他们的化学特征是什么呢 ？So ignore them. 这一句话。同组有同样的化学特征，这四组呢就不要提起了。Understand？ 好久不见啊。OK，Next，、okay, 下一个带的。The relationship between the arrangement of electron in an element and the position of the element in the periodic table of element. OK，This、okay, is another long title， so maybe I decide. I make another video. I make a video shorter, so you can have a rest, drink some tea or coffee, 喝一些咖啡和茶 Or when I making the video short, I can prevent a lot of error. 我可以预防很多错误了 Otherwise, when I making the video, 我在录的时候啊，有一点错误，我整个要录过 So I better stop here. 我在这边停，这个变成新的 video， 会吗 ？OK. Or when I upload, 我不要这样等这样久了，它可以分成很多 video， 你可以停一下。整理整理，你能弄一下 ，OK， 拜拜。